They're called voice of God weapons. Dr. Terry Robertson was seeing a lot of patients with the same problem. Well, I've been collaborating with some other physicians and some former DOD scientists that have been looking at citizen complaints that they may be being subjected to what's known as psychotronic weapons and biocommunication technologies. The complaints seem to be increasing. I've specifically been working with one self-reported group of over a thousand what are called targeted individuals. Targeted individuals, define that for me. What is a targeted individual? This is a moniker that these people have put upon themselves. They believe that they are specifically targeted. Targeted individuals. They're the ones who say they're being harassed and tortured by voices in their heads. The ones who are mocked as people in tinfoil hats. These aren't just crazy people. These are regular citizens who feel they're being targeted. This is a highly educated group. Over 50% of them have a college degree. Over 12% have postgraduate degrees. Highly educated people. How could they do this to thousands of people at one time? MK Ultra, microwaves. This could be the explanation for these people's symptoms. When MK Ultra came to the forefront and it became public knowledge in, in the 70s, in the 70s, the government said they canned the program. It was gotten rid of, and you're chuckling over that. Is that untrue? Well. <laughs> I mean, just, did, did they get rid of the mind control program, or no, did they no, just rename no, it and no. take it somewhere else? They just, it was a shell game. They just simply moved it from one uh, agency to another. As it became more privatized, going into technologies at that time, they had a procedure where they actually put a transmitter, transceiver in your sinus cavity, and it was hardwired into your brain. What would they use today in substitution for that? Microwaves. So they actually send things through the airwaves? Yes, they can. And they, and they can target one individual with this? Do they have the ability to do that? Well, yes, and they also have the ability to, to do mass populations. They have the ability to do that? Well, there's a variety of answers, and all of them go back to the same thing. Electromagnetic pulse. The electromagnetic pulse. Streamed from a microwave tower, it can mimic human brain waves, create anxiety and pain in people, and create human speech inside their heads. The best kept secret is the one that is right in plain sight. They put thoughts in their heads, they hear voices. What would be the government's purpose for doing this? Absolute control. Mind control of their own people? Yes, and absolute control. Is this a rogue element of the government, or is this our mainstream United States government doing it? Our mainstream, sir. So it's not a band of criminal hackers after all? Not at all. It's also highly compartmentalized, like all uh, sure. projects. You're telling me they're doing this right now? Yes, sir. It couldn't be much clearer than that. The technology that sends messages to secret assassins is now being used to squelch dissent. We've run into a few people that claim they got voices in their heads, they sleep inside tinfoil boxes, they do a lot of crazy things, it seems. But when they talk to us, they seem totally normal. They seem totally sane. Are these people crazy, or is the government doing this to them? The, the government's doing this to them. Is the government doing this to them? The, the government's doing this to them. They're called voice of God weapons. So you know for a fact that these weapons that you worked on, they're being used domestically today? Absolutely. You have to remember the CIA has a long history of experimenting on our citizens from right. LSD. Sure. Okay, we're talking here like going back to MK Ultra and all that in the 60s and 70s. But we were told all that stopped. Is that untrue? Untrue. These programs continue under new names, new budgets. It's the ultimate weapon. To your knowledge today, are there citizens of this country that are being abused with this technology? Worse than abuse, that's a light word. They're being tortured. So the targeted individuals aren't crazy after all. Control the population from subconsciously to consciously. And now we've got a motive. Controlling dissenters, controlling the world, 
controlling you and me. With your background and what you know, can you give us a hint on what we ought to do? No. No. Is it too late? I actually believe it's too late. So what you're telling me, every one of us should be in fear of this because every one of us at some point will be targeted? The technology's advanced that far. I was very uncomfortable and I knew something wasn't right. I was terrified and confused.